really do. Oh, is that I, hey, listen. I'm not the claw. Well, and we've got Chez here. We're not sure of the pronunciation of the last name. Am I calling this one? Yeah, go High crotch, scoop and a slam. Chez set to go one on one with the claw. Set for the right, eats the back elbow, does Chez, and the claw all over this man. Jack knifes him, picks him up, power bombs him from the ring canvas. What kind of core strength? What kind of lad strength? What kind of back strength do you need to do that on someone the size of Chez, who I understand goes, depending on the day, anywhere between 260 and 275? Oh, Soto Gary modified and once again those naked elbow strikes. We've seen that from the claw before Sent for the right is the claw. It was so nice. He hit the ropes twice gets caught once again the modified STO double palm press Referee in position not even a one count Ladies and gentlemen, you are watching the best wrestling you're gonna find fight to survive We do this every week as we see the claw once again drop that guillotine leg drop. Takes his man into the corner. Tommy Rice learned a little bit earlier on what it's like to be in the ring with the claw. Chez now learning it. It's gonna be a brawl. I mean, it, it's, it's chaos, it's frenzy. Nicely done. Gut buster that time. Interesting way to get into it, cover. Hook the far leg, wanted to get three, only got two. And the claw has been in full court press mode all night. The claw not letting up. The claw not letting Chez breathe. The claw not letting Chez have an opportunity to come back. Trips his man from the outside. Pulls him back out. Now stomping the knee is the claw. Sends Chez. Sternum first into the guardrail. Chez very smart. Put the brakes on. Collar and elbow that time, and once again, the modified Osoto Gary. The referee counting. The referee getting to seven, and now both men back inside. Sandwich Lariat, another stomp. Chaz not looking great in this thing. There we go, comes back, drops the elbow. Chain two moves together. And now once again, we see these two hockey fighting in center ring. Who's going to come out on top of this one? One punch, more nasty than the last. And actually, both guys went down. It was a war of attrition. Inverted Texas Cloverleaf now, and he drops back. Almost shades of Rhea Ripley that time. One of the more talented female wrestlers in the sport. Vertical suplex. The claw sends his opponent over the top rope to the outside. Chaz now. Trying to taunt, trying to fire up, psych himself up, get back into this thing, and ends up right back outside. And that's just the back of the man's head on the concrete. And he was very lucky to sidestep that chair because that would have been it. The referee counting at five, both men back in. Chaz Smart makes it back in sooner. Sidesteps him, not sure what he was looking for there. And once again, it's that gut rent. The gut rent. Once again, he hits him with that nasty move. Easy for me to say. Gut wrench, gut buster. Shinonaki slam. Named after that train station in Russia. Pops his man up. Hits the Samoan drop. Double palm press. Thank you for coming. No. Only a two count to the surprise of most of the people in this arena. They thought it was done. I know I, I surely did. Chaz picked back up. Sent to the corner. Now perched up on the Falcon's nest. See what this is going to be. No. Turns it around. Came off the top like Kerry Von Erich. Like Kevin Von Erich. Like all the Von Erichs. That turnaround cross body. And once again, those nasty exposed naked elbows. A boot that time drops the big man. Hey, this claw guy is someone to be reckoned with. I've said it before, but I had no idea what to expect when this guy signed earlier this week with this organization. This guy might be a future champion. Picks his man back up, does the claw. Electric chair down. And now he might be taunting on it. We talked about it before. Does he have, you know, some kind of claw? There it is! And we talked about the Von Eriks. Let's talk about Fritz. That iron claw. That will be it. 
And you gotta give Chaz credit because he made it to that rope and a lot of guys would not. Modified Achilles lock that time. Chaz now coming back. We saw the three-quarter broad chancery. Follow that up with the elbow. Bootlace rake now looking for the power bomb, but there's the back body drop to counter. Once again, the claw back in control. The range wasn't quite right on that first one. It was on the second one, but Chaz able to slide out. And now looking for a little assistance via that steel chair. And that's it. That man just got himself disqualified. The claw is going to take the win in this one. And there's that nasty claw again. And he's squeezing his head like a grapefruit. We're going to have to get some help out here. Five minutes, 32 seconds via disqualification. The claw goes over Chez.